All day long, Local 24 News is honoring veterans, those who have protected and sacrificed for our country. Veterans are one of the hardest hit populations when it comes to homelessness and physical and mental health issues. Since the 1980s, Alpha Omega Veteran Services has stepped in to meet the need. Local 24 News reporter Brittany Moncrease on how the pandemic has impacted their operations. Omega Veteran Services has helped more than 11,000 homeless and disabled military veterans transition back into society. Just because we're in the midst of a pandemic, it doesn't mean the effort stops. Their staffing has been short with the need ever great. Alpha Omega Veteran Services has one mission, helping homeless and disabled veterans. We basically provide uh, food, shelter, clothing and all of the rehabilitative services necessary to get our clients back on their feet. But during the pandemic, staff quickly had to switch gears. Our staff has doubled their workload uh, because now we're transporting food three times a day to the clients, making sure that they're getting to their meetings, their appointments. While following social distancing guidelines. We've had to expand the program and extend it to hotels that are around the area. We do not travel in groups anymore. They even have to be cautious about donations. We do not uh, accept a lot of the uh, outside donations that we have in the past uh, to make sure that we don't uh, bring in the virus. We have very have had very few to any viruses that have uh, broke out here at Alpha Omega. And they want to keep it that way. With winter shuffling in and COVID cases rising, the need has grown. We're always in need of, you know, having masks and gloves and the support. Especially on Veterans Day, a reminder to be a keeper to those who kept us. Our veterans are on watch every minute of every day of every hour, of every month, of every year to protect and safeguard our freedoms and liberties. You know, the life, liberties, and the pursuits of happiness that we're able to indulge in is because of our veteran population. We celebrate those veterans, both past and present. We honor you and we thank you. In Cordova, Brittany Moncrease, Local 24 News.